Well, hello everybody, Mike Grum Productions here. We have recently gotten a sneak peek of the all-new Sons of Garmadon coming 2018, I think, but we got a new Lloyd instead of the Lloyd that we're used to. He is completely different, and he even has a different voice actor. I'm gonna compare the Lloyds so we know why they're different. Okay, so first off, we have the original Lloyd. He used to be just a little kid, but now he's developed into this whole teenager thing, and it's actually really cool. As you can see, he looks like a normal human. But because he's the legendary green ninja instead of a normal ninja, it makes him stand out from the rest. He gains a bunch of different powers all the time, and he ends up growing up and learning more about himself and becoming a man. One thing that makes him unique is his voice. Most Ninjago characters don't sound like this, but l unlike everyone else, Lloyd has a female character voicing him. It makes him sound kind of kiddish, but also serious sometimes, and it's kind of an interesting feature, but that's what makes Lloyd, like, you know, uh, unique and special. You can see that Lloyd is voiced by Jill and Michaels, which is not a man. Well, at least, he was. Unfortunately, though, a, a while back, Jillian Michaels was fired, just because Lloyd was growing up, they say. It's really sad to know about this, and it's really hard to adjust to any other voice of Lloyd, because this one was just more original. Listen here for the original Lloyd's voice. Moro is the green ninja, and he's stolen the realm crystal. I tried, father, but how? I'm not the green ninja anymore. I won't, father. But if I destroy it, it could destroy you. Now that's pretty good voice acting if I do say so for myself, even though it's not a man. Also, notice Lloyd's hair. His hair is short and kind of has bangs, but it's not like long or wavy or anything. It's a pretty cool hairstyle. Now we move on to the new Lloyd. Here he is, guys. The new Lloyd. We're gonna have to adjust to knowing this guy for the rest of our lives. But we are getting the Ninjago movie, so I guess we shouldn't really be concerned. Anyway, about this new Lloyd, he looks pretty great, but there's a few things about him that makes him different than the old Lloyd. For example, look at Lloyd's eyes. They're green. I mean, he's the green ninja, but ninja aren't supposed to have, like, colored eyes. They're supposed to be normal eyes. So why are his eyes green anyway? Is he some kind of an alien or something? Well, whatever the case, we know that his design is based off the Ninjago movie, because in the LEGO Ninjago movie, he also has green eyes. Look, see? He has green eyes there too, so it's kind of obvious that they deliberately did this off the Ninjago movie Lloyd on purpose. Another thing we know, we know that Lloyd is growing up now, so we can tell that he's no longer gonna sound kiddish, he's gonna be more like an adult, like an actual grown-up. He even has a new voice actor since Jillian Michaels has left, or, sorry, Jill, Jillian M Michaels, sorry. But yeah, like, we know she left, so he got a new voice actor that sounds a little more professional and makes him sound less kiddish. Here's Lloyd's new voice that we're just gonna have to get used to now. Pixel, I need my car. You're somewhere over... You know how to find me. <laughs> I can kiss you, Pix. Yeah, I'm here. It's time to get the team back. Personally, I kind of miss Lloyd's old voice, but this new one actually sounds kind of good because he's growing up, so he actually needs to sound much more cooler, and this pr pretty much works for him. But face it, you miss it. So do I. We all miss his voice, I bet. But we're just gonna have to get used to it. He's growing up, so we should too. That means getting used to his voice. Also, if you notice, his hair is different. I mean, it was like, ba it's basically the same, but for some reason it looks a little longer and more wavy, like the, his hair has grown or something. It looks w actually really cool, but it's kind of also d really different. It's not really like what we're used to, but remember the Ninjago movie? We got that too, so yeah, but it, it's still like, okay, so it still works for us. Also, one other thing. Dan and Kevin Hageman, the creators of Ninjago, they just confirmed that the ninja are going to be redesigned to match the Ninjago movie. I'm not really sure why they would do that if the movie's not even canon to the series, but it's probably best not to question it. Anyway, as I was saying, if you thought Lloyd looks weird now, just wait for the other ninja. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think of the Lloyds in this video, and I'll see you around.